<laughs> Hi, uh, my name is Sarah Brownell. I'm a senior lecturer here in the Kate Gleason College of Engineering. I'm also director of the Grand Challenge Scholars Program on campus. Uh, but I wanted to, I came to, oh, it's March 1st. Um, it, it is the Beyond the Ratio event that I came here to attend. And I'm gonna to respond to the first question. So why is it important for you to participate in this event today? And um, I just, I really wanted to come over and show my support for the changes that the campus is, um, is making to try to embrace all gender um, and sexuality and uh, <laughs> racial identifications so that we can all be a, a community here on campus. But I wanted to talk a little bit about how things have changed since the time when I was a student. Um, I was a mechanical engineering undergraduate student in the 1990s. And at that time in the engineering building, there was only one bathroom uh, for women, like just one single stall. And there were only three women in my graduating class of mechanical and engineering students. Um, at the time, there was a Women's Resource Center on campus, but it only had a part-time employee and a number of student volunteers. There was a student employee. One of my friends was actually the student director of the Women's Resource Center. We had a small room down here underneath the union, and we really spent a lot of time fighting for a full-time employee for the Women's Resource Center and also trying to address the way that sexual violence was handled on campus. Um, we were looking at harassment in classes and actually called out a number of professors related to the way they were talking about things in classes or treating their female students. Um, at the time, my friends who were in the LGBTQ plus community, they were all in the closet, at least, you know, for the general public, maybe out with their friends. And that was all, maybe not even with their parents. It was the time when Matthew Shepard was killed. Um, so there just was a, a, it was a lot different than it is today. And it's, it's interesting that we've made so much progress, although there's still a lot of work to do. Um, Martin Luther King said that the arc of the moral universe bends towards justice, but we also have to keep in mind that it only does that if we keep pulling on it, keep pulling it towards justice. 